Hello, my name's Chris, this is Blue Kraken Gaming, and welcome back to Stellaris with the Democratic Corinth Singularity, where if you are enjoying the series, I would ask that you please consider leaving a like, a comment, or a subscription. Any or all help the channel grow, and they help get it out in front of other people, so thank you very much to those of you that do that. Now, in our last episode, we were continuing to make more facilities for producing uh, neural chips for our synaptic lathe, which we are still working through. So we've got quite a few research chips going on in here. Um, we've only got 37. I kind of feel like we, we should have an awful lot more. Um, but we're going as, as fast as we can with that. We also went to war after we had our random invasion here that, you know, just upstarted and knocked out those two systems. But what it did do was it re-gave us access to this system here which i am kind of ecstatic about because we went to war with these individuals and now we are just trying to take all these gaia worlds which will be amazing if we can get that done so where are our armies ah they're already down okay cool excellent now one bit we do need to work out we have a deficit on alloys and consumer goods which is an interesting one and rare crystals so have we got anything we can directly do with the alloy shortages here I don't know that we have I mean, we can upgrade that do we even have an we have got a mining world that is already maxed out it's already got its purification hub and the chip factories is trade that's fine. It's not a problem. Oh yeah, we do want to upgrade those. Make, build the uh, build the chips faster. Absolutely want that done across all of them. Um, as we give you your energy hub as well. Now, it does mean that I'm sitting here going right. How do we get more alloys? Uh, not alloys, minerals. We are using the research concluded arc furnaces to try and get that going. Right, uh, do we have anything going here? I've set time running now. So, let's get... Don't want to do Cosmogenesis yet. Let's get Dark Matter Deflectors level 4. Because I feel like I want a lot more research before I try and go into that. Uh, we were also refitting all of our fleets so that they are... Yeah, the skip rays and battleships now. So we've got all of those going, which is good. Initial colonization phase complete. Excellent. That gives us Titans. Oh, there's our battle cruisers. Definitely want that. Planetary incursion initiative successful. Good. They succeeded on their assault. And they're going on to the next one. Construction Beautiful. Project That's concluded. what we want. Okay. So in the meantime, we can continue to bomb the various worlds to reduce their army strength. So I think that's just going to wear away on its own. Uh, we will let the masses mourn, because energy is not a problem for us. Uh, right, so we've lost a Minister of State, which means we need a new official, which is a bother. Let's have a look. Stability plus two on the council, that's worth having. So we will do that. And we will continue to push up your stability. Uh, you can then go into the Galactic Council. Be our representative there. Awesome. Okay, that's still ticking away. We don't need to activate the Khan. Don't need any of that yet. Uh, army, how are they going? Oh, that's the invasion over. I don't know where they've gone next. 2A, how are you doing? Planetary yeah. incursion initiative <laughs> successful. Cool. They're after the next one then. I feel like this war's not going to be very long. Because after all, it is only one system. But the nice thing with that is it does mean that hopefully we will be able to... Well, we get access to all those Gaia worlds, which would be great. Hopefully we can set a couple of those up to improve what we've got going on. Now, how... I cannot remember. What are our... Uh, okay, so we've nearly got unyielding done. This, what were we saving this for? I don't want the Colossus project. Uh, 
uh, yeah, Galactic Wonders and the Arcology Project. Yeah, those are the two I definitely want next. And we don't have Defender of the Galaxy yet. Planetary incursion and is that because we can't successful. have Defender of the Galaxy? Oh, that's the core of the main shipyard. I'm guessing we can't have Defender of the Galaxy, seeing as we are becoming a galactic threat. Project concluded. Okay. Didn't realize that was going to disappear. Incursion initiative. Interstellar Dominion, Galactic Contender. Yeah, they're all... they're not alphabetical. Interesting. Uh, right, okay. Either way, we can let all of that continue to wear away. We've got some minerals there to come back. That's fine. Right, where is... There we go. Planetary we incursion initiative successful. Right. Let's have a look. Arc Furnace. Where have we got good spots for an Arc Furnace? That's not a good spot. Mm, this would have some, so you can go there. Uh, we want to upgrade the Mega Shipyard. Archaeological site. Oh yeah, because that's the Zarkland Chamber, isn't it? Yes. That's going to be fun. I do want to try and get these alloys straightened out. Oh, what have we got? Uh, let's have a look. Particularly observant operative in the Sacred Sovereignty has laid their grappling clamps on part. Ah, an encryption key. Interesting. This bodes well. Okay. Wow. Code breaking plus one to two concluded. I kind of wish the... Uh, the... Um, subterfuge setup was better than it was and I wish it did more right can we negotiate our agreement with you you are a protectorate we could make them a satrapy I'm not too worried about satrapies uh, yeah. construction project concluded can you give us holdings yeah but that's going to upset you way too much let's have two holdings Uh, you guys are... Can we negotiate your agreement? You are a vassal. Oh, we can only make you a protectorate or a satrapy. Because everyone is so technologically inferior to us, we can't have specialist. Okay. Fine. Uh, where is... Uh... Oh, there they are. Okay, so they're trans... Burring. That garrison is tiny. Why have you not landed on this world yet? Oh, because that world's taken. Is this the only world with anything left? So why are we not landing here? I'm not sure what they're up to. Commencing planetary right, okay. incursion initiative. I know, because that world's got some left as well. Garrison of 800. And that's my garrison. And that should... This one should be over fairly quickly. Yeah. Okay, so let's buy a load of minerals to keep us going. We're also shy on rare crystals. Hmm. That's going to be something to bear in mind. Okay. Oof. They're knocking these troops around a fair amount. Wow, that defensive army is pretty strong. 3.8 to 7 and we do 3 to 6. Okay, they don't seem that much stronger than us. But they do seem to be whittling through us pretty quick. Right, what we can do though is grab everyone. And move them into taking out this one world. Cool. Okay, so that world is now done. Initiative successful. Yeah, they're heading over there. That's fine. But we need to reduce the uh, troop strength on this world. Okay. Uh, that's a tomb world. Let's colonize. Oh, yeah, we could just re... I don't have climate restoration. Okay, all right. Well, we can work towards that, actually, because that might be better Receiving transmission. than you colonizing them with tomb world set up people. 
Because if we can use... If we can restore the climate there, then we'll be all hunky-dory. Right, you've got that upgraded. Excellent. How about you just get those set up? Just get those mining bits done. You're all the way over there. That's good. That's hopefully going to try and straighten out some of our mineral usage. Particularly so I can... Oh, that one's upgraded. That one I can add more to. Okay, that's good. An aggression pact. Broken. Okay, that's fine. Okay. So that's going okay. Just got this one last world to knock into submission. There we go. Yeah. With everything on there, that should be going okay. Right, let's get into fleet management. Let's reinforce a load of our ships. Wow, okay. Uh, lost to bureaucracy. Yeah, we've got the influence. Yeah, we're going to invest in that area. Right, there we go. And then we can have... Unyielding... Resistance is frugal. So that means all of our defense armies now also give us additional unity. Cool. So you guys have now landed because you think you can take this world. Excellent. Right, what we got? Oh, that's right. Let's reverse engineer some arcane technology. Cool. So that's wearing away quite nicely. There's not huge amounts that I want to make moves on here. What's going on in the galactic community at the moment? Enable Planetary vetoes. Yes, I would like that. Successful. Oh, we beat them. It is unforgiving. Excellent. So. Oh, they're immediately in a... Oh, awesome. Right. Population. Can you guess that? Yeah, they've all been set to undesirable. So they're all going to move... Yeah, instead of purging, let's actually just straight up move them. And this should really help our... Um, oh, wow, okay, there's loads of them there. Right, this should really help our... Um, oh, no, I don't want to de destroy the colony. Right. So you guys should be assembling someone. Right, let's replace that with a... Uh, where are we? Robot assembler? There we go, robot assembly plant. Okay. Right, synaptic lathe. How many... What, available housing? 105. Right, okay. So that world's gone. So then we can come to this population and resettle these guys onto the lathe. Move them all across. Uh, and then what we can do is we can come to capital and we'll just move some people over. So we can actually do that with Sol X as well. Put those there. Then I can go back to the lathe. Move them. Uh, right. And then it was... This one? Yep. Move them over. Uh, and then this one. We'll come back to the home world. Send over a super corinth. And then you guys will go into the lathe. This is going to massively up our um, tech research. And because I'm doing it this way as well, yes, it's costing me money. But it means I don't run the risk of them escaping. Right. Uh, Dacha. Come here. So I appreciate this is a little bit of menial work, but I mean, this is what we do, isn't it? We do an every-click playthrough. Uh, 
undergoing assimilation. Yeah, you can stay there as a robot. Uh, that you do. Right, and then come back to the lathe. I feel like I'm going to need to build some additional housing on the lathe because this feels like it's going to be a big increase in populations there. Now, I know, arguably, this is not the right thing to do for these... Um, interesting. Uh, these colonies, but it's what I want to do because I really want to bump up that industrial lathe. So... Ooh, we got a research chip there. How do we get research chips there? Right, okay. Lathe. Move all this across. And then what we will probably wind up doing is just do another sweep of our chip factories. Right, there we go. More research chips. Excellent. Chip factory beta. There we go. Research chips. Move them across. Chip Factory Charlie. I do like how they're named Chip Factories. It makes it easy to find what I'm looking for. Cool. So that's that done. How? <laughs> yeah, these are going to need uh, some serious reworks. Right. Replace that with the robotic assembly plant. Replace that with the robotic assembly plant because we need all of that coming back. Uh, wow, trade. Replace that with the assembly plant. Give you an assembly plant. Give you an assembly plant. And then I'm just going to turn on the automation for all of these. Uh, but I spotted at least one of these. There you go. You shouldn't be an urban world. You are going to be a mining world. Uh, and your automation, you are allowed to... Uh, oh. Okay. Well, it doesn't look like they're allowed to take down uh, buildings. So I will do that for you because I do not need all these trade zones. Take all this down. Right, okay, that's that done. I mean, you're f fine as you are-ish, yeah. Overworld, no. You can be a tech world. Actually, no, you, oh. They're listed as a four world, forge world. Look at all this tech. Uh, repair that. Yeah, okay. I'm going to leave that as is now. Right. Our synaptic lathe, that's what I want to check. Ah, so yeah, we are now definitely under on housing, so... We need to get a couple of these districts down, because that's impacting the stability. Oh, look at all that tech! Wow, we should be flying through the tech. Project concluded. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Minus 14k on... What? How are we at minus 14k? So we're producing that. Megastructure ships. Jobs. Is that... Oh! Oh, that's all those neural chips. Oh, they're costing us a huge amount of energy. Oh, wow. Okay. I full-on miss that's what would happen there. Uh, okay. How do we fix that? How do I fix a 14k energy deficit? I mean, I can sell some dark matter. Don't think that's going to keep us going. Yeah, I don't know how we fix that. That's oh, giving us volatile moats. That's 
best. Hang on, where are we losing volatile moats to? Monthly gain. Produce. So we're using a load in buildings. Okay, all right. That's where we've taken these over, isn't it? Have you guys got a load of upgraded buildings I need to worry about? And that's going to use gases. And those guys won't. That will. That's going to use a lot of gas. It's producing some gas, but again, I've got no one working here yet. Okay. Okay. Um... In which case, let's go to... And I'm not keen on this. I don't like the idea of it. Right, showing Empire Species. Where are our new super... Super abundant people that we've got? These guys. Right. Instead of undesirables, you guys can be assimilation. And then, we're going to take all of them back out and <laughs> this is probably a bad idea uh, of the synaptic lathe right just put 20 back on each world and you've got 44 spare jobs how many did that have you had 55 spare jobs okay all right, well, let's go back to that then. Right, you have 44 spare jobs. We'll move you guys back over. Because that's going to be less damaging than leaving them all as lathes. It will take us a little while because they've got to be assimilated, but that's still going to be better for us. Right, you needed, what was it? Oh, I can see behind, right. So you need 58 jobs. Now I'm out of money. That's fine. We'll sell some more dark matter. Blood the market with dark matter. Right, okay. Uh, there we go. So you needed... 55, wasn't it? No, 58. Okay, so we spent loads of money moving them, and now we're spending loads of money moving them back. Yeah, this definitely wasn't the smartest move. Should have thought that through a lot more. Do let me know in the comments whether this was something you were shouting at me about before, it, before I went and did all of this. Because I feel like this is something that you all would have been like, No! Stop! What are you doing? Uh, right. Lathe, move you guys back. I'm hoping this is also going to affect our deficit. Right, you need 91, so you're basically going to take almost everyone left. Right. Come on. Yeah, I I did not think that one through at all. Right, and then you, 25. You will get the last ones that are here. Right, okay. How many has that left us with on the lathe? Okay, so that's already made the lathe better. Because now we are no longer shy on resources. It's massively nerfed the production we're doing. Loads of these. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why is everyone upset? We've had a lot of people cancel embassies with us. Why? Doesn't say. Okay. What's that done to our economy? Okay, minus 500 is more tolerable than minus 14,000. And once those guys finish assimilating, that should hopefully sort a lot of that out. But you're still building those. Okay, I'm hoping that's going to sort out a lot of the consumer goods issues as well. Yeah, look, loads of people are withdrawing their embassies. Why? 
curious as to know what we've done to upset so many people. Uh, ooh, champions of the community. Yes, let's have that. Thank you. Right, okay. Don't want to use any of those just yet. Oh! The next Nexus has claimed a system. The Jundus system. These guys. You're you're really gonna push for that, are you? You're pathetic! Your fleet power is shocking. Uh, right, okay, let's move our entire fleet back here now then. Because they can move back into orbit and that might help with the energy shortage as well as they get docked. Uh, you could be hyper focused, Mr. Shadow Weaver. It's remarkable because we've all seen Zarklan before. Blocker clear. Okay. Yeah, no one's building because we don't have a. We've got a deficit at the moment. Unemployed jobs ready to migrate is fine because I think we've got plenty of space for them to go at the moment. So I'm not too worried about that. Alright, we'll speed it up a little bit. Research concluded. Hang on. Someone else has claimed the Ustir system. Which one's the Ustir system? Oh, that one. Okay. And who's done that? The Confederation. These guys. Okay. Okay, so you're kind of stretched. Oh, you're the guys we broke into. Okay, all right. Loads of people have suddenly got very upset with us, and I don't quite understand why. Do let me know in the comments if you know why everyone suddenly got very annoyed with me. Okay, we're shy on food. That's fine. We can sell Zro and Dark Matter. Right, how is our... How's the assimilation of... No, not the armies. How's the assimilation of the population going? Growing. That's fine. We're still assimilating a load of them. Research and that's eating into our food. Okay. Why were you unable to do those? Okay. Alright, that's because you're on auto build, that's why. And then... You're on auto build. This one. Build mining stations, please. Right. We are going to be showing food again, so let's just buy a big amount of it. And then sell a big amount of dark matter. Okay. Oh, good. Our energy deficit is declining, which means we're hopefully getting people coming Council through. Agenda available. Let's get the artificer output up. Uh, where are we? Champions of the communities in there. That's good. We've got an agenda we can launch. Oh, that's just on cooldown. Okay. Construction project concluded. Let's get the fleet being upped again. Research this concluded. Going. Right, good. That's that done. Let's get our neutron launchers. Another day, another scientific breakthrough. Uh, our mega cannon. Do I want mega cannon? No, not in. Not really. I don't want the mega cannon. Let's get advanced destroyer hulls. Uh, right. What can I get here as another upgrade? Oh, yeah, defense grid supercomputer. That'll work. Get that on all of them. Because then we can get more defensive emplacements. Right. Uh, I don't have the alloys to build those, so that's fine. There we go. There's the Zarklan bit for anyone that's not read it before. Cool. So. Okay, cool. Ship's back in dock. We're in the plus on the alloys and energy, which is good. Mega shipyard is fully online. 
which is perfect. Which actually means, that means we've got a fully upgraded mega structure, which means I think we can get, yes, Galactic Wonders. Construction project concluded. Absolutely want that. Okay. Research concluded. You who have no orders, can you get me a... I need to research them first, don't I? We got that. Lacking 17 alloys. Okay. The science nexus. Uh, well, that feels like it should be in this system. Okay. But apparently it won't let me. So where can I put that? I want that somewhere central so it's safe. Yeah, put that here. Because the science nexus will be good for us. Right, what can we get next? Black artillery. Let's get the art better artillery going. Construction project concluded. All right, we're gonna have that flurry through in a little bit. Construction project concluded. Cool. You're set to automate. You're all full of fortresses, so concluded. you should be fine. Uproth. Do I have one in Uproth? And Jundis. I need one in Uproth and Jundis. Actually, a defensive facility. Right. Why? Why are these people upset with me? I really don't understand. We currently have temporal relations. We don't have intel as to why. Okay. Alright. Really don't understand what, Research what we've done to upset the galactic community. Uh, I bet I bet it's going to war with those arguably neutral people and, and taking them out. Uh, I'll bet that'll be what it is. Let's get an interstellar assembly, see if we can cheer people up. So, buzzword standardization. Uh, no, we're going to veto that, thank you. Uh, right, what's on the floor? That's our champions of the community. Research Good. I think we're then going to want... Uh, under galactic reforms. Uh, oh. Oh, I thought we could be galactic custodian going down this uh, path. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Okay. Let's get... Yeah, uh, let's get the matter decompressor up first. Keep righteous. Okay, and I'm going to wrap that up next episode. So, as usual, likes, comments, subscriptions, they'll help the channel grow. they help get it out in front of other people. So thank you very much to those of you that do that. Thank you very much to my patrons and YouTube channel members. Your support is very much appreciated. And please don't forget that as a supporter, you do gain access to the save files for any of the open world games that I'm currently playing. But other than that, thank you all very much for joining me today. I hope you have a great day, and I will catch you all next time.